lightweight, versatile. I'm talking Wolf Pup. Stepping inside a Wolf Pup, you're going to notice there's a lot of coziness inside. But cozy doesn't equate to quaint, as in Wolf Pup, you're going to get a lot of features normally associated with larger travel trailers. Check out the kitchen first. You get a very large fridge, 12 volt, 11 cubic foot one, complete with a travel lock. The kitchen also includes nice items such as seamless countertops, high rise faucet, high output microwave, and stainless steel range hood above the flush mount high output cooktop with cover. You'll also be comfy cozy in the temperature with a larger than expected 13,500 BTU AC. Keep you and yours warm via the 20,000 BTU furnace. And as far as entertainment goes, heck yeah, the Wolf Pup is loaded with high standards. You're going to get inside and outside speakers, plus something a little special. You get an 8 inch ceiling mounted 200 watt subwoofer with accent lighting. But am, and it's blue. Pump out the tunes. Also, for those who love to plant their eyes into small devices, there are USB charging stations all over the place. At night, sleeping is easy with the nightshades pulled down. They do not pull down automatically, but how can you access controls for things that do, like the slides, where applicable? Well, via the Cherokee Total Control app and remote control system. Yep, this includes monitoring the tanks, getting out the power awning with its LED light strip, and hey, since I'm talking about the awning outside, what do you say we step outside? There's that awning, nice and long and bright. Notice the exterior. With the Wolf Pups, you got two options. You can get the standard conventional look or bump it up with the smooth fiberglass option available under the black label moniker. Now, that's a pretty sweet look, I got to tell you. But let's talk about keeping those puppies level. Every Wolf Pup comes with a quick jack as well as four stabilizer jacks. So, once you're level, you can stay stable. Getting into your campground spot is easier via the Cherokee backup system. Not prepped for a camera, it's already there. Awesome option. Now, what is prepped, as a lot of folks love to drop in their own solar panels, is solar prep. But it's wired and ready to go. All you need is your panel. What else is ready to go? Let's see. Oh, more entertainment. You want to watch TV outside? You can as there is an exterior TV mount on every Wolf Pup and a TV antenna plus hookups. Come on, man. Most also have a sweet little mini kitchen, the Pup Kitchen. Places to store your gear? Absolutely. You're going to get front storage and Wolf Pup bunkhouse models will also have an exterior door access for another great place to drop your camp chairs and more. The exterior also has a very handy shower with hot and cold water, plus an exterior 110 volt outlet. Now, don't get mixed up. Shocking. Ah, get it? All right, hang on. Get back to it. Let's take a second to talk about the tires. Every Wolf Pup has nitrogen filled tires, and those tires are 14 inches, so wider than standard, which is better for towing. Also, in case you run over a screw or a spiked collar, because you know you wear those, you get a spare tire. Now, let's talk about the floor plans. Wolf Pup models are consistent in their size. Most are going to tip the scales under 4,000 pounds unloaded and hover around 23 feet long. Most Wolf Pup models are designed for the camping couple, but what do you say we start by checking out some floor plans that are made for the family? The 16 VHS can sleep up to five due to its twin stacked bunks, convertible dinette, and queen bed. You'll find a handy storage plus door with the lower bunk, a mini kitchen outside, plus an exterior TV mount. The 17JG has a slide out to make the interior a lot roomier. You'll get twin stack bunks with a storage plus door, a large U-shaped dinette, and a queen bed. Therefore, you might be able to sleep up to six in that one. Outside, you're going to get a mini kitchen and a TV mount. Now, if you're camping with just you and your significant other, the 16FQ utilizes the versatile Murphy bed system, or as Forest River likes to call it, the Cherokee sleep system. So you have a place to lounge and hang out before hitting the sack. You'll also get a mini kitchen and a TV mount outside. The 16FQ can sleep up to three. The 18TO has a very large slide out that includes a secret hidden bunk. But is it a true bunkhouse? To be honest, I say no, but a lot of people like to argue with me, and I'm okay with it. 
As it is, that hidden bunk is right above a jackknife sofa, and the 18TO can sleep up to five, which is pretty nice. Outside, you're gonna get what? That's right, mini kitchen and TV mount. Wolf pups have the versatility to make you howl. Hey, look, I had to, man. I've been holding it in this whole time. Find yours at rv.campingworld.com. And hey, while you're at it, if you like these videos, please do us a favor, click like, subscribe, and notify. So the next time we get one of these ready, you're the first one to get it. I'm Chris Young, and as always, happy camping.